most important, I had a telephone call yesterday. The toll wasn't incidentally as great as the one I made to you fellows on the moon. <laughs> I made that collect incidentally in case you didn't know. <laughs> that this is the greatest week in the history of the world since the creation, since the creation, since the creation, creation, creation. Because as a result of what happened in this week, the world is bigger, infinitely. The world is bigger, 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 infinitely. And also, as I'm going to find on this trip around the world, and as Secretary Rogers will find as he covers the other countries in Asia, as a result of what you've done, the world's never been closer together before. The world's never been closer together before. And we just thank you for that. And I only hope that all of us in government, all of us in America, uh, that as a result of what you've done, we can do our job a little better. We can reach for the stars. We can reach for the stars just as you have reached so far from the stars. We don't want to hold you any longer. Anybody have a, a last word? How about promotions? Do you think we could arrange something? <laughs> Oh, we're just pleased to be back and very honored that you uh, were so kind as to come out here and uh, welcome us back uh, and uh, we look look forward to getting out of this quarantine and, and uh, great. talking without having glass great. between us. Uh, and uh, incidentally, the, the speeches that you have to make at this dinner can be very short and if you want to say fantastic or beautiful, that's all right with us. <laughs> <laughs> Don't try to think of new, any new adjectives. They've all been said. And now I think, incidentally, that... Uh, all of us uh, who, the millions that are seeing us on television now, seeing you, uh, would, would feel as I do that, in a sense, our prayers have been answered. And I think it would be very appropriate if Chaplain Pirto, the chaplain of this ship, were to offer a prayer of thanksgiving. And if he would step up now, Chaplain, thank you. Let us pray. Lord God, our Heavenly Father, our minds are staggered and our spirits exultant with the magnitude and precision of this entire Apollo 11 mission. We have spent the past week in communal anxiety and hope as our astronauts sped through the glories and dangers of the heavens. As we try to understand and analyze the scope of this achievement for human life, our reason is overwhelmed with abounding gratitude and joy, even as we realize the increasing challenges of the future. This magnificent event illustrates anew what man can accomplish when purpose is firm and intent corporate. A man on the moon was promised in this decade, and though some were unconvinced, the reality is with us this morning in the persons of astronauts Armstrong, Aldrin, and Collins. We applaud their splendid exploits and we pour out our thanksgiving for their safe return to us, to their families, to all mankind. Grant us peace, beginning in our own hearts, and a mind attuned with goodwill towards our neighbor. All this we pray as our thanksgiving rings out to thee, in the name of our Lord. Amen. Amen. A disposizione avete il fantastico e completo indice alfabetico attraverso il sito tinelli.eu. Sempre a disposizione, in bianco e nero, il libro Il Risveglio, a colori solo nella versione ebook. book